Chapter 33. I rubbed my hands across the table, gathering wood dust in between them before I flung the excess behind me, causing a picture to show. The two of them looked in awe as an image formed of a familiar face appearing in all black. This is Zempyro, I pointed behind me. He was the Alpha and Black Flame. They both nodded their heads in agreement. What made him the Black Flame is what makes any Pyro Dragon the Black Flame, or any Arrow Dragon smug, which is pain. Confusion covered their face and I could tell that I lost them. Let me back up. So this Zempyro was a very loving individual. I nodded my head and they nodded with me. However, over the course of several years, he started to experience a series of disappointments and heartaches from the people that he loved. This caused his blue flame to start to darken over time. Finally, it caused him to become the black flame. So, this isn't something that they're born with? Some power question. No, they just need the opportunity to get their feelings out with someone they trust. Okay, so why did I feel a sinister presence when I connected with him? Because he hasn't been fully honest about his feelings, which is odd because we talk all the time. Zempyro and Max slightly jumped from their chairs. Yes, I said that is my godson. He is my baby. Everything that goes on in his life, he tells me. Very well. So we don't have anything to worry about? Not necessarily. Just get him to be honest and open up. And gear him on the right path. I mean, you are both his grandparents. I tried smiling from a genuine place to get them to not worry and accept my explanation. They returned the smile and nod their heads. I waved my hand and they were back in their sandwich shop. I am grateful for the Abraham spirit. It's a spirit that you use to confuse your enemies or people that could be the ops. Like Abraham did when he said that it's not his wife, that is his sister. I mean, everything I said was true for the most part. I mean, the stuff I had to tell the royals of the Dragonlands. <laughs> my lord. You know what? Let me show y'all. 